in this presentation, we will go over an introduction to motor jogging in PowerPay Mac. We will review jog move profiles, learn about command syntax, jogging online from a terminal window, as well as the PLC program. In industrial automation, motor jogging is the simplest form of closed loop control that can act on a single or multiple motors at once. These jog commands can be independent or simultaneous. Conventionally, jog moves are not intended for coordinated multi-axis motion and typically perform using motion programs. They are, however, ideal for point-to-point -point or indefinite motion in a given direction. Motor jogging can be performed online from a terminal window or in a program such as a PLC. Jog moves are trapezoidal velocity versus time profiles. They are programmed using three essential motor structure elements, jog speed, jog TA and jog TS. A jog move profile consists of three portions, an acceleration, a constant velocity and a deceleration. Jog speed specifies the magnitude of the constant velocity portion, whereas jog TA and jog TS specify the shape of the acceleration and deceleration portions. When jog TA and jog TS are positive, the acceleration and deceleration are defined in time. At various speeds, the total acceleration time is the same. On the other hand, when jog TA and jog TS are negative, the acceleration and deceleration are defined in rate. And jog TA in this case represents the acceleration rate, jog TS represents the jerk rate. Therefore, at various speeds, the rate of acceleration is constant. An online jog command consists of the pound addressing a motor number followed by a jog command. All jog commands will close the loop on the motor before executing the jog commands. Some of the most common jog commands are J slash decelerates the motor to a stop in a controlled manner bringing it to a closed loop zero velocity state. J plus jogs the motor indefinitely in the positive direction. Alternately, J minus chocks the motor indefinitely in the negative direction. J equals a constant chocks the motor to a position specified by the value of that constant. The complete list of online job commands can be found in the Power PMAC software reference manual under the online command section. Conversely, program job command uses a slightly different syntax than the online commands. A program jog command starts with the word jog, followed by a symbol, then motor number. Some of the most common program jog commands are shown in this table. The complete list of program jog commands can be found in the Power PMAX software reference manual under the program command section. Online jog commands are executed from the terminal window in the IDE. In this demonstration, we will use the motor number 1. J slash is the most popular PMAC job command. Issuing pound 1 J slash, as explained previously, brings motor 1 to a closed loop zero velocity state. Pound 1 J plus jogs motor 1 in the positive direction at the speed specified by motor 1 dot jog speed. Changing jog speed on the fly does not take effect until the next jog command. For that reason, PMAC users often change the jog speed and issue the jog command on the same line. In Power PMAC, regardless of their respective acceleration and speed settings, multiple motors can be jogged at once. Ascending motor numbers can be separated by comma, dot dot or a combination of the two. J slash closes the loop. J plus jogs positive. J minus jogs negative. J is equal to zero jogs to zero. Jogging a motor properly from a PLC requires a few simple but important considerations such as checking status bits and using time delays. In order to demonstrate this, user variables jog plus and jog minus are inserted in the watch window with an exclusive or operator creating two software toggle switches that change state every time they are pressed. This allows us to simulate the functionality of a control panel so that when a button is held down, 
the motor jogs in a given direction and as soon as it is released the motor come to a stop emac plc's scan rapidly as fast as a few microseconds therefore short time delays should be inserted after jog commands this allows some time for motor to start executing the command and status bit to take effect accordingly in this sample plc when jog plus is pressed the jog plus command is issued followed by a 100 millisecond time delay the ensuing while loop waits for the in position bit to clear indicating that the motor has started moving this usually exits quickly and the next while loop waits for the jog plus button to be released as soon as jog plus is released the jog slash command is issued followed by a 100 millisecond time delay the ensuing while loop waits for the in position bit to be set indicating that the motor has come to a stop this protects the process against mechanical or electrical switch hysteresis note that awaiting for a while loop condition to be satisfied power pmax scans or the plc alternately the same logic can be applied to jog the motor in the negative direction Thank you for your attention. We hope that this video presentation was helpful. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact your local Omram representative.